it's, it really has transformed my life. And that's within six weeks. I mean, it's only a short period of time, but, but the impact has been so major. So we are currently receiving in the region of 600 referrals per year um, and those referrals are coming from all across the borders and um, from all areas of communities um, and we are seeing a kind of exponential rise in those referrals over the last five years um, but we're also very very aware that that is very much the tip of the iceberg. When I was taken very ill very suddenly and had to have one of my kidneys removed and I was really unwell after the operation. I completely lost confidence in my body and my ability to do things and then I was invited to take part in these programmes which have been very helpful. I, I think it's fair to say that the, the evidence that we're capturing from the health conditions programme that exists in the borders is that it is really, really benefit, benefiting those people who, you know, who are coming into the programme. So currently the health conditions programme that Live Borders is operating is 100% funded by, by us as, internally as an organisation. There is no additional funding coming from Scottish Borders Council or from NHS Borders. The reason we've kept going is because the, the engagement from the kids, um, the enjoyment from the kids. I, I think for me, a breakfast club was a tester to see how it goes and it's been really successful in the way that it's socialising with them. So the impact of the Active Schools programme on children and young people is massive. Um, we cover primary one right through to S6. Um, the, the impact will vary, obviously depending on the age that we're looking at, but at a basic level, physical activity has its physical benefits. So getting fitter, being more aware of your body, getting a better night's sleep, you've got your mental and emotional well-being as well. And at some point, we are going to need to take a look at how we fund all of the activities that we'd expect it to do from a Live Borders perspective. The support we get from the, the, the Live Borders staff and uh, the volunteers who help them, it's just unbelievable.